Hello YouTube friends, I'm Nadine, I'm with the Quiltmobile, and I want to just hurry and do a quick introduction of the video today. Uh, two weeks from today we'll be traveling to Pahrump, Nevada, and we're going to be uh, participating in their quilt show down there. And it is called, I, ha I have to look at it on my phone here, it, they're on Facebook, it's the Pins and Needles Show in Pahrump. And they have several wonderful things. I'll be showing a slideshow. They do a bed turning event um, that the, I, I videoed it uh, in, in between the last couple of years. This will be my third year doing their show. It's, it's absolutely wonderful. So they'll be doing a bed turn event uh, again. And that starts at 11. It is on April 5th and 6th. And so I, they'll be doing it twice a day at 11 and 2 o'clock. They do demos. They have a quilt appraiser there, Terry Holloway, and she is amazing. She's a good friend of mine. And so it is so interesting to hear what she goes through on how she determines the appraisal of our of our wonderful quilts that ladies bring in for that. Um, they do a English paper piecing uh, uh, demo by Linda Crawford. Can't get my words straight right now. Darla Holt will do, be doing binding tips and tricks. And then, uh, let's see, I hope I say this name right. Violet Tuchton, Tuchton is, is doing a thinking outside the box. So they do wonderful, wonderful things um, on that. And then on, that's that's just on Friday. And then on Saturday, there's more. They, on Facebook, they have this listed on there. And so, and like I say, it's in Pahrump, Nevada. We're going to leave two weeks from today to get set up for there. So on their Facebook, you can see all of this wonderful in information called the Pins and Needles Show. You don't want to miss that one. So what I'll be doing too is is showing the slideshow of, of everything that they have um, that they've done in the last couple of years that I've attended. And so I just wanted to show you some of the newer items that I'll be bringing and putting on the quilt mobile. And I'm going to take you along with me in the next two weeks, uh, packing up the quilt mobile. I'm going to clear all of this out of here. I just, I did a little, a little display back here behind me to kind of clean it up, but everything is going to get redone in here and I'll, I'll take you along with me and show you what I'm doing. So I've made three new kits that I'm putting on the quilt mobile. This is one of them. Midnight Rose Garden, Ancus Treasures, and I'll have patterns and kits available for that one. There's also a separate pattern uh, for this one that is a uh, table runner, I believe. I actually want to make a bed runner. Uh, I'll probably double the table runner and make a bed runner. I think that would be fun. I'm putting this one on the quilt mobile. I love anything and everything patriotic, and I love this one because it is several branches of our military. Love that. I will be spotlighting this one by Tara Reed, a good friend of mine also. She visited me last year on the quilt mobile and I love that. Her and Jennifer, they both signed the, the wall. I have autographs up here of quilt designers, magazine editor, and that, it's just been a lot of fun. I will also be doing a book review on my next video. I'm, I'll, I'll do that one. I don't have time for that one today. But it's on this one. Lori Holt, Be Happy Quilt. I will, I hope to make this quilt someday. I think it's beautiful. Th this book's been out for a little while. But um, what it is, I think is such a, such a wonderful book. Is it shows all of Lori's uh, techniques in here. And the amount of blocks that you can make from one book, and I mean, we're talking table runners, uh, pot holders, everything. It's just, it's just so beautiful. I love this book. So we'll be doing that. Uh, also be showing you a uh, featured Black Rabbit's Closet. Is she sending me, her name is Jessica. Go on her, go on her website. She has wonderful gift ideas. Right now she is featuring a box that is centered on uh, quilting, sewing. She has a, a bunch of wonderful items in her in her mystery box. It won't be a mystery to you guys on what is in the box, but I won't open the book that's in the box so that that, that will remain a mystery. So kind of a spoiler alert that I'll be showing you what is extra in this mystery box. 
So I hope I earn your subscription today. Stop by, say hi to me in Pahrump, Nevada, April 5th and 6th, and uh, I hope to see you soon.
do the unboxing of this beautiful quilters box right now from the Black Rabbit's Closet. I'm doing a little voiceover right now and uh, so I just, my other video didn't work that I had planned, so I had to redo it. Try did not work out. So these are the goodies that you get in this, it's a, called a mystery quilt box. And so what it is, I'm try, trying to look at my camera through um, uh, my screen and I'm not seeing where my hands are actually at. You get a cute little mug. I love that, that is so cute. I'm not even gonna read it to you. You guys all know how to read, right? And you get, oh, of course, Jessica, she does she, she does so many personalized things. Cute little thank you, little thing here. I already looked at it when I tried my first video. Cute, cute little teapot, little decanter. I think I might even hang this from the mirror of my car. I just think that is so cute. Hubby will, will take it down because anytime I try to put something in my car, he always takes it off, off of my mirror. I, it makes me mad. And then I have a little tea blend, and it's just so beautiful. I will be probably sipping on that this evening because I got so much to do today that sitting down with a nice cup of tea later on. Always a wonderful handwritten note by Jessica. She just does so many wonderful things. She actually drew the Black Rabbit's logo. She designed that and sent that in and got a stamp. So you get a wonderful little embossed wax melt seal right there. And let me see. Oh, I love this. I will be putting this on a little, as a little shelf sitter in my sewing room. I just think that is so adorable. Very vintage, little antique looking scissors here. I don't know if they're actually antique, but boy, what a fun little shelf sitter for that. And then we have, oh, this is this is something extra. So, <laughs> empty box, but what is in, that? this is sold separately. So this, oh, I dropped my tea canter. So, okay, these are earrings from Jessica's store. These are sold separately. This does not come in the, in the quilt themed box. But uh, these are actual porcupine, uh, quills in an actual bullet it cased and I, I was so impressed when I first opened these they are so lightweight I mean they are like air air they don't have any weight to them I can't wear dangly earrings if they are if they're real heavy I just I don't know I just can't do it and these are quills from a, uh, Africa porcupine quill and they are from Beth Dutton. She wore these on the Yellowstone series. I love that. I think, uh, I don't know if I can say it, but I just think that Beth is such a badass. I love her. At first, I, when I first watched the first episode, I, I just thought, oh my goodness, she's horrible. But then I, I actually, I, I love her. I, I, if I could be as tough as her, that'd be great. This is the mystery book. And it's just, it's just so, Jessica wraps things so beautifully. So it's, you won't know what the book is if you purchase the, the quilt theme box. She's got her embossing here. I have actually saved a little hat pin, so cute, put that on a project box, bag. And I have actually saved some of her designs, the way she decorates everything, and have made a card out of some of the, the items. I'll definitely try to save the, the washi tape off of here and use it on a card maybe. I love that. Let's see, what else do we got here? We have uh, Jessica's business card. And, oh, I don't think I showed you the, uh, as well, or no, I think I did. A cute, bag and I love the saying on that I think that is adorable and it's a good size bag it's got the box the box uh, corner so it's a lays out flat and the heftiness of this is really good it's a really good quality quality bag to take to a quilt show and then Jessica she she had this uh, kind of she lists everything that you order from her and then this little magnet, little book, book, 
um, mark was on there. I won't, I won't open it right now. But so there's that. And then a cute little thank you baggie that's got a couple pieces of candy and some tea. I love that. Everything is just so wonderful in here. And I just, I really, I've, I've ordered a couple of items from Jessica. And they are all just the amazed with the quality. And she has different themed boxes. I've ordered a couple for some friends. And I just um, have had rave reviews from them when they, when they get given as a gift. So that's it. Oh, and then here's a little, a little vinyl sticker was in the mug oh and then oh yeah okay okay so that's it that's my that's my sponsor um, trying to promote the black rabbit's closet with a lovely lovely quilt gift to either keep for yourself or give to a friend